It's a front grip diving out, or also known as a muff dive. Um, safety first. So what are we looking out for in terms of falls? So you're here in Burr. You're going to dive through the folded leaf. Pike, right. And you're coming through here. Right through. If your legs are not piked, you're going to fall straight down onto your base. If this is not straddle pike and your feet are up there, you're going to fall straight in. So very important to keep those low. Okay, back to Burr. Let's walk it first. Bird, folded leaf, and dive through. A common mistake is the shoulders that are too big to get through. So flyers, if you curl your shoulders in, you can do that by crossing your arms. So Siobhan's crossing her arms like that. She gets through. From here, she's going to take her hand and grab my feet, the top of my feet, right there. What that does is it allows me, or she's going to help support some of her weight as I take my hands on her back here arms locked. If my hands are bent at all, she's going to fall straight onto me. So when you flip forward this way, Siobhan, you'll feel the support in your back with my arms locked, but also you're going to be able to pull your weight with the hands there, okay? It'll be easier as you're coming over to stagger knee and bring one over at a time. So keep one leg on this side as you bring one leg over. Okay. So slowly come over. There you go. And then down, feet down, pull onto my feet and then come up. So now that you know the motion, as you're diving through, you can feel that motion and push off my feet and then exit this way. Okay, let's do that again. We're going to burn here. We're going to fold it leaf. She folds her arms across and gets small. We fit her through. My hands are stacked. She grabs my feet. Her legs come one down, one down, and she pushes off my feet out. And you can also use your hands to lift her out and push her out. And you as the flat push off the feet and push yourself out this way. Anything I can clarify for you guys? Give it a try. Let's do it.